slide this around wherever you want it. You want it to be a little bit towards the back or right here. Now you've got your draw here. Buddy Brad C here. Just wanted to do a quick review on something I got off Amazon and I just want to see if this is going to be any good. This is the Comfortac Ultimate Belly Band Holster. Personally, I have always been an Alien Gear holster man. I mean, I've got several other holsters that I have reviewed on the channel. I like them, but Alien Gear is pretty much my go-to holster on most of my guns. And I've got a review coming up on this gun here specifically, the Glock 43 Davidson's Edition in the Stars and Stripes, the FDE color. I love the looks of this baby. I've been putting off getting a Glock 43 for a long time, and I just... I tried the Beretta Nano as a small little gun. It was supposed to be this ultimate survival compact gun. No, I'm sorry. I cannot hit the broadside of a barn with that Nano. So I had to get something that I could hit a target with. Now the Alien Gear has a ankle holster that I'm going to be reviewing and I'm very excited about that. It's coming very soon, probably next week. So that was the goal, was to get something that I could use for ankle carry. Now also, I wanted something that, in case I was wearing something other than what I'm normally wearing, like, you know, as you can see here, Bob is sporting my LBX tactical pants, which I love, but it's hard to get them off of him. So when I'm wearing what I'm wearing now, which is, you know, these basketball shorts, it's not going to be optimal. And always keep in mind the cost. I think this thing is right about 20 bucks. So, you now I figured for 20 bucks, I'd take a chance, put a review out of here on the channel and, and see what we think. I'll put links in the description to Amazon. I'll also put links in the description to Alien Gear Holster and the new ankle holster if they have it on Amazon. Okay, now, something I probably shouldn't look into before I ordered this. One size fits up to 44 waist. <laughs> That's going to be pushing it for me, so now I'm getting a little bit scared. All right, here's what it is. I will do the review anyways and hope for the best. It's called Comfortac, Comfortable Carry Solutions, so I'm assuming it's probably going to be comfortable. At least I hope it is. Feels like a quality material. You know, it doesn't feel uh, super cheap by any means, so... Let's get it out and take a look. Okay, I got it out, and if you notice there, I, I was trying to open that with one hand. Uh, that's not happening. This Velcro is very, very powerful, and I definitely needed two good hands to, to pull that apart, so that's that's a good thing. Looks like it's a really nice stitching. No complaints there. Uh, it does feel very comfortable to the hand. Now, one side is actually looks like a wicking type material, so that's going to keep down the sweat. Now, on this side, you have a pocket, which is going to be the holster, I guess, for your gun, and you also, it looks like they have a little Velcro attachment where you can attach it anywhere you want. And it's, uh, you know, a place where you can put a, an extra magazine. I just want to show you how stick on here this is. I mean, look at that. I'm pulling that about as hard as I can. It's just barely coming off. That's impressive. Uh, I tell you what, if nothing else, these guys should uh, pat themselves on the back for developing the ultimate Velcro uh, attachment system here. This is some, that's impressive. Okay, now if you have a nice 36 inch waist like Bob, you're going to see this thing is sweet. You know, Bob has got him a serious carry piece here. So if he ever goes out and wears his basketball shorts, he's going to be well covered. Luckily, this thing actually fits me. Now, not as well as it does Bob, but believe it or not, it actually fits my waist. Just show you how it works. I mean, obviously, this goes on here really and secure. It's impressive how, you know, this Velcro itself sticks. You can spin this however you want this. And you see here, there's actually one where you can take it out of that. I guess you could actually carry two. Put it down in here, and then you've got this locking device on top of it. Personally for me, whenever I carry like this, I'm probably not going to want this on here, but nice to have that if you do. For me, it's more of, you know, I've got to take the dog out for a walk or I've got to walk to the park or whatever. I may actually cut some of the end of this and I think they've made it to where you can pretty well just you know, probably rip that open to where the barrel of your gun would actually sit down a little more in there, get it a little bit more secure. Just want to show you a quick mod I made. I took my little Essie Kandaroo and I cut the stitches just a little bit here to where I could fit the barrel of my gun down in here. We'll just give it a good heart shake. Yeah, that's not going anywhere. Now, if you missed my review on the Kandaroo, I'll put a link down there in the description and I'll also put Amazon links. It is definitely my little go-to knife as far as just my little cutting knife that I like to, to keep handy, kind of a neck knife type deal. Okay, I'm going to show you how easily it goes on here. Basically, it's just kind of like for back support or whatnot and fits in there nicely. Definitely conceals. It's, it's comfortable. 
I mean, obviously you can still feel something there, but if you're wearing basketball shorts or sweatpants, this is definitely a good solution. Much better than uh, those shirts that have these built-in pockets and you gotta reach in around here. I mean, here you just got it here and you're out and ready to go. So, I mean, this is, in my opinion, a sweet setup. Now, reholstering it is gonna be a little bit more complicated you would not expect to do that with any kind of great speed but the, the print is not bad and you can slide this around wherever you want it if you want it to be a little bit towards the back if you prefer it right here so now you've got your draw here ready to go so not bad I like it Personally, I just keep mine wrapped up like this, and I've got it stored in a very high place near my front door when I go outside to take the dog out, or if I go on a walk to the park or whatever, I can just grab this, strap up, I'm ready to go. Definitely, if I'm going to have regular pants, I want Alien Gear holsters. If I'm not, I've got basketball shorts, then this is definitely the way to go. Okay, that is a quick tabletop review of the ComfortTac system. I will update you in the future how that goes. I'll also be doing some upgrades to this Glock 43. And if you've not seen Spec Ops channel, I'll put links in the description. He is one of my go-to guys for anything Glock. Anytime I think about buying a Glock or a Glock accessory, I usually, you know, skip over to his channel and see what he's got and nobody says Glock as cool as that guy just want to add stay tuned to the channel you'll be seeing all the upgrades that I do to this gun and you can see a glimpse of them here the NDZ performance pieces the night sights by True Glow the TFOs laser max guide rod laser three different mag plates by NDZ pinky extension plate and the plus two mag extension and the fab defense plus four magazine extension all right guys make sure you like subscribe and you can check me out at bradctv.com Thank you.